y'all welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is T thank you so much for stopping in don't be a stranger feel free to hit that subscribe button before you leave and make sure that you turn on that notification bell so that you don't miss an upload for me and if you are returning welcome back thank you so much for your support today I am going to do the long-awaited Amazon chair video for you guys. I actually have a really good excuse why I haven't gotten this video out. I was supposed to do it a couple months ago, but I was actually going to order more chairs from Amazon. So I was on the hunt for them. I couldn't find some that I was like totally obsessed with. And then a light bulb went off that I have 72 tables in this house and that I could probably spread out some chairs. <laughs> actually, I have this table, the breakfast nook table. I have this table in the kitchen and of course the dining room table in the dining room. So one day I was actually in the dining room. I was rearranging as I always do. And I put four chairs back instead of six. And then I noticed that if I don't put chairs on the end of the table, then you can actually see the detail of the table. Plus you don't have to lose weight or be skinny to walk by <laughs> to go around the table. So I decided to take those chairs away. It looks so much more clean and open and airy in there. And it doesn't look too crowded. So I really love the way that the four chairs look. And so what I decided to do was to take those chairs away and put them over in the breakfast nook area. So that's what I done. What I originally was going to do was have my husband build a bench in the breakfast nook area and I was going to put it over near the window and we were going to have two chairs on the other side of the table. But I decided against that because I really am obsessed with the open airy feel of the breakfast nook area. So after doing the measurements of the bench and seeing how tight that it would be over there, I just completely decided against it and thought it would look so much more cleaner and pretty for just having two chairs over there. Plus, I always put my Christmas tree over in this area and I didn't want to have four chairs plus the Christmas trees over in the corner. It would just be too much over there. So I'm completely obsessed and happy with it. Moving on to the chair. I love them. I've had them since May 2017 and they've held up so great. I'm not going to tell you how much I paid for them because I actually can't remember, but you know how Amazon, they fluctuate their prices up and down all the time. So they could possibly be different from what I tell you in the video. And then you click the link down below and it'd be completely different. So I'm not even going to go into price. Um, but like I said, I can't even remember how much I paid for them, but they were not expensive. They were a really great buy. So I was actually telling my sister the other day how nerve wracking it was to order such a huge... Um, thing from Amazon because that box is so big the chairs are large if you have to send it back it would just be a whole ordeal and she actually informed me that she purchased a mattress from Amazon I would have never been brave enough to order a mattress she said she loves it so maybe it's just me not giving Amazon the credit that they're due but I am now because I absolutely love these so now I'm gonna give you my pros and cons of the chairs so let's start with the fact that these chairs could probably be used in any setting that you place them in. I love the fact that you can style them up or you can style them down. If you have a farmhouse, modern, um, glam, any type of setting that you put them in, I really feel like these chairs will kind of blend into your space, that they don't really jump out and scream any particular type of style. I think that that's perfect for any space. Another pro about the chairs, you don't have to use these for dining room chairs. You can use these for an office. You can use them for um, like a breakfast nook area. You can use them for the kitchen. I've even seen these chairs be used as an accent chair and it actually worked really well in the space. You just have to know how to style around it. But these chairs can be used anywhere. Another pro is that these chairs have a really thick cushion. I love a chair that I can sit in for hours and not have to get up and move around because my butt fell asleep, which is perfect for when we have family dinners or anything like that. We have people over throwing a, a dinner party or anything like that, and people are sitting for long periods of time in the dining room, having good conversation. The last thing on your mind is how your legs or your butt is falling asleep because the chairs are uncomfortable. The padding in the seat is so thick, which leads me into my next pro. The uh, cushions are so wide. I am a girl with big hips, number one, but two, I absolutely love sitting with my leg up underneath my other leg. <laughs> I like sitting on my leg. So when I sat down, I want to have a seat that is wide enough for me to do so because that's comfortable for me and that's how I sit. I know a lot of people who sit like that and the cushion allows for that to be comfortable for you. So if you like a wide seat, this is the chair for you. Another pro is the fabric. Okay, so this is kind of a pro and a con at the exact same time. So the fabric is not necessarily microfiber fabric. 
it is like microfiber but it's more of like a velvety microfiber so these chairs right here in the kitchen those are microfiber and i can literally just take a damp cloth and wipe out whatever it is um, that's in the chair these i can do that with but you have to do it like almost immediately so if you have something in the chair you can't allow it to sit for a really long time unless you use scotch guard now when i went to go order the chairs they you know how like at the bottom of like the amazon thing they pop up and say you know order these two together and this is the price for it well they also had the scotch guard which is perfect so that you can go ahead and put that in your cart um but i did not scotch guard these chairs and if I'm being completely honest with you guys, this was a last minute purchase. We had family coming and I had a dining room table, but I didn't have chairs yet. So I wanted to make sure that I was able to accommodate everybody who was coming. So it was kind of a last minute purchase. I'd went to a bunch of stores around here and looked for chairs and I couldn't find six chairs in my price range uh, for the, and the color that I wanted. Everything was either the wrong color, $400 per chair, or they only had two chairs. I think they were here within a week, maybe like three days, three or four, they were here within like three or four days, so that was perfect timing. We had time to actually sit in them and make sure everything was good before our family got there. Which brings me to the cons. So when you get the chairs, they come in a pack of two. I ordered three packs. So the silhouette of the chair is actually already put together. All you have to do is turn the chair over and then there is a zipper part. Inside of the zipper part, there is a stretchy uh, kind of bungee material under there. And underneath that is gonna be the legs and the screws and the Allen wrench and all of that stuff that you need to put the legs onto the chair. I did see the reviews where some of the seats were kind of smushed on the edges and it's because of the way that they do the packaging but if you give it just like a day or two then those will kind of form back out at least mine did so the chairs come with a piece of paper all of the information and it also has a phone number and it says to please contact us if there are any damages or if you have any problems or issues or anything like that so i actually had a leg that only had a socket for one screw so i took a picture of it and I took a picture of the piece of paper because I had like the stock number and all of that stuff on there. And I emailed it to the company along with my name, my address, and my phone number. I had a new leg to me within like two days. It was so quick. So the fact that that leg was messed up was no concern to me at all because the customer service was so good. So the last con chairs were a little wobbly. It weren't like rocking chair wobbly, like where the legs are different sizes. It was just underneath it where um, maybe it just rocked, like just, a, just enough to get on your nerves. <laughs> but the good thing is that I always put like felt tips underneath uh, my chairs. Just like the little felt tips, you know, the little felt pieces. And then you cut them to, you cut them, <laughs> you cut them to size for whatever chair you're putting them underneath. Or you can go to Amazon um, and they have the little bottoms that you put on the bottom of chairs. So it has like the felt piece on the bottom and then you just nail that into the bottom of the chair. And I actually may get some of those. Um, if I can find the link, I'll link them below. I may actually get some of those, I'm not sure yet. I don't know how they'll do with these chairs, but. I probably should have already ordered them, but I haven't. I think that is pretty much it. I can't think of anything else. If I think of anything else, I will have it in the description box below. Um, and if you have any questions, please feel free to ask them in the comments. I would love to answer the questions that you have. I hope that you enjoyed it. And the upcoming videos, oh my gosh, Christmas is coming, you guys. Look, I, your girl is ready for Christmas. Do you hear what I'm saying? Do you see what I am saying? This is the first year that I am doing YouTube and decorating at the same time. So I'm really excited to get the video out to you guys. Um, I think I'm gonna start out with a clean with me and I'm gonna put all of my fall stuff up and uh, give that video to you guys and then we're gonna start with the Christmas stuff. I really was gonna wait until it started to get cold outside until I couldn't raise my windows up anymore but this weather is psycho. I don't know what it's doing and it's, it's just too much for me. I'm gonna do a clean with me. We're gonna pack up all of the, the fall stuff that we did. If you saw my decorate with me for fall and then I'm trying to debate whether I wanna do like a vlog for Christmas decor. I can split it up into a couple of videos because I have a lot of Christmas stuff. Or 
if I want to just do a decorate with me for, for Christmas. I don't know yet. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Let me know if you want to see a vlog or if you just want to see a decorate with me. I would really love your feedback. It would help so much. I'm gonna turn on Christmas music. I'm gonna make Christmas cookies. Wear a Christmas hat while I clean just so that I can get into the spirits. I am so excited. I just got Lexi some, let me show you Lexi's pajamas. Y'all, she is going to hate me, but it's gonna be so cute. So I got this at TJ Maxx the other day. Oh my God, so cute. Oh, if you are new here, Lexi is my dog. So I got this for her. It's got the little bunny ears on it. It's so cute. And I also got her these dog socks. Are these not so cute? I got these at TJ Maxx. They were only $2.99. And this was only $7.99. She's going to absolutely hate me once we put that on her. So last year we did pictures for Christmas. If I can find the video of her like little onesie that I put on her to match us for pictures, then I'll put it in here. It's so funny. She was so mad at me. Lexi, you like your pajamas? on her for a long time so she'll be okay but that's it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed i hope that this was really good information and i hope that you subscribe turn your bell on so that you don't miss an upload if you're not following me on instagram feel free to do so all of that information is in the description box and we will see you guys in the next video Bye. Let it